dudes and dudettes of YouTube. What is the deal? This is Frank with What's the Point EDC, and we're doing us a walk and talk unboxing here. As you see, this uh, box to my buck is <laughs> its no good. It's just no good at all. I got it from Walmart. So it's the H line. Oh, I love this freaking little buck. Let's check this thing out. Give me one second to tuck this box away, guys. So I'm just out and about walking. Ain't much going on out here besides this buck. <laughs> Look at this. Let me stop for a second so I don't trip. Let's take a second to admire this beauty. Look at that. That's a nice looking knife. Does this look like any buck to you? No. This is so different. This is like the buck 264 I have. Oh, that's freaking beautiful. Look at that. Huge doodad hole right there. But you can see through that. Look at that. Let's look on through there. Yeah, let's go ahead and keep on walking and talking. So it's got D2 steel from my understanding. Go with me. Stone washed. Go with me. Frame lock that's protected. Go with me. Deep carry pocket clip. Go with me. Sweet back spacer. Go with me. <laughs> Finger forward toil, whatever you want to call it. Good with me. Hold on. What? Jimping? Good with me. Because looks like we are good to go. Look at the action. Listen. We're outside and it's snapping. Show. And I'm not even trying to snap that thing open. Mmm. Look at that. So it's like a protected frame lock. You see that? I'm literally in the middle of the street. <laughs> Children, do not do this if you're watching me. I do not recommend this. Do not walk and talk blindly and play with knives. So, what do I like about this? I love the action. I love the look. I like the G10 inlays or whatever you want to call that. I like the hole in the blade. Blade steel is great for me. If it had been a, a better steel, it had to cost more. So for the 30 something bucks I paid for this, D2 was perfect. Look at this beauty. Let me give you a quick look at that edge. Mm, that's nice. Watch this thing drop shut. Well, I let go of the teaspoon. You guys get it. You can choke up. You know, I'm a big fan of being able to choke up on something. Dang, Buck. You did it on this one. Shoo! Yes, you did. Man, that thing clacks, don't it? Dudes and dudettes, this is a nice one. Buck, you're stepping your game up. Uh, uh, uh. I mean, this, this wouldn't be a, uh, a what's the point EDC video if I didn't give you another buck to go with it. Now, let me put that one up. Let me get that. Ah, 264 Cavalier out. Tell me Buck ain't doing their thing. Buck is doing it up. Let me give you one more little ah, sweetness. Come on, Buck. You freaking, you're doing it. I don't care what nobody says. At this point, Buck is destroying the competition at 30 bucks right now. This little knife is freaking fire. Although what I will tell you, in all honesty, in my $30 knife category, the best action on any of my $30 knives is going to be the Honey Badger Warren Cleaver, the large version. I am telling you, I put some KPL on that thing. Holy freaking moly. You want to talk about some good action, but look at this. This is brand new now. I haven't done anything to this. This is as it is. What a nice knife. Damn. All right, my peeps. If you're an addict, never quit quitting. Be safe. Stay strong and live long.
Much love, my peeps. I'm outie.